Well, guys, my uh, GE water heater, let's go through it. Guys, just give me the state. We don't need it. Um, this is part of retrofit. Water heater's working fine. Um, it's just a good, cheap unit that if you need something for your barn or, I don't know, maybe yours failed and you don't want to spend $800 on a 270-liter unit. 270 is pretty big capacity. I'll put all these specs in the ad. Um, all the hardware is in place, so you can just hook it up. Um, this was cut as opposed to unscrewed, so that's good for you. Um, the only point of note is that the cosmetic cover that covers the wiring is missing. So if you're a tinsmith, you can just cut yourself a new piece. Or, I don't know, put a piece of cardboard over it. doesn't really matter. It just covers up the uh, wiring for uh, basically the control, the control unit itself. Um, the main wiring unit is down here. And uh, that does have the cover. Um, I've taken a photo of the bottom. The bottom is fine. There's no issues with the unit. It's nice. It's clean and straight. So the bottom line is it's a retrofit and, uh, well, not needed. So you get to win. I'm going to take some photos, higher quality in the video. I'm not asking too much money. Delivery will be noted as an option, but you just might want to pick it up. It's really up to you. But the cleanness of the unit sort of gives it away as far as its viability. And I, I believe it may still be under warranty. But uh, I'll uh, throw those figures into, um, into the Ream system. And um, yeah, it's a good unit. Send me a text, email, or phone call. Thanks, guys.